in this video we will install customize uh, CLI in our local machine so there are some prerequisites for this one so I have created this readme document and I'll be publishing this to my git repository and I'll share the link of the git repository in the description of this video where you can find all these steps so the prerequisites are you need to have a local Kubernetes setup so that we can do all our hands-on labs I have this uh, video in my channel uh, where I have shown how to set up a local Kubernetes cluster using uh, kinds this is one prerequisite the other is you need to have kubectl client tool kubectl CLI okay so you need to install uh, this tool also so that we can interact with uh, our uh, Kubernetes environment so once you install this kubectl client let's say if it is greater than 1.14 version then customize comes a pre-built uh, with this tool okay so you can try out uh, by running this command so when you run this command let's say I run it in my local okay it says kubectl client version is v1.27.1 so it also has this customized version right so if you have kubectl which is greater than this version so you need not to install customize explicitly but let's say if you want to have like a uh, standalone you don't want to like work uh, with the uh, kubectl uh, CLI and you want to directly work with customize uh, client tool uh, customize CLI then I recommend you to you know follow these uh, steps like just curl uh, this URL and uh, it will take care of like setting up uh, customize CLI in your local so once you have that you move it to your uh, local bin directory and uh, you can check uh, the tool version using this command okay I have already run this uh, and uh, here I have this version right so I hope uh, you will set up in at your end so I have done my local kubernetes setup also so i have this cube ns these are the power tools uh, cube ns cube uh, context so these are the handy tools which we uh, which can help us in you know saving a, a lot of time for us so i'll share the link of these power tools also so that you can use it I have created this namespace called customize tutorial so I recommend you to create a tour and also so that we can uh, create everything in this namespace only so that's it for this video I'll share uh, this link so that you can go ahead and set up a tour so from next video onwards we'll explore customization right thank you for your time see you in next video